All right, this is Kevin Cook. Thank you for coming back to Heavy Construction Equipment Podcast. And this episode, we're going to talk about construction of tunnels. And again, this episode has been sponsored by me. Are you looking for good, used, quality equipment? Then come to my website at www.startractor.com or call me at 817-733-3799. All right, here we go on the podcast. Construction work at many times can be quite challenging, and it can be not everybody's cup of tea. This means that the construction companies are into building high rises may not find themselves comfortable building dams or tunnels. They may have their experience in one gender of their business, and it is definitely does not mean that they can try something else in in the same industry, but for projects that require experts to work. It is recommended that companies should stick with their gender of the business and not move into other genders. Gender. However, if they still want to try, then they need to first gather enough details about the kind of work and also process the requirement equipment to execute the project. Construction of tunnels is one such job that requires an expert to deal, deal with. Companies dealing with construction work other than building tunnels may not understand how to begin and where to end the work. Therefore, it makes sense for the construction companies that have been dealing with the construction of the tunnels to dig their heads into it and execute the work with finesse. Number one, investigate the land is important. Investigating the ground conditions is quite crucial to the start of a major tunnel tunnel project. The company should first collect the supplies of the boreholes by adopting the geophysical techniques. Once that is done, everything should be okay. You should start with the excavation work. Now that in the veg, in, in the investigation part, it is crucial because it will help experts foresee any possible dangers that might erupt once the construction work begins. Availability of heavy equipment. Heavy equipment plays a significant role during the entire process of the construction of the tunnel. The company needs to have the best machines in place and also the best operator to control the machine. Now, when we talk about heavy equipment, it is very crucial is the excavator. When you go about to construct a tunnel, you need to excavate the ground and rock to pave the way. This work can be really dangerous if not done correctly. The operator needs to be very cautious when he or she is working on such complex projects. An experienced operator should be given the task to excavate the rock. Try not to involve a newbie in this project. You always have to have experience, expertise. Once a way is paved, the layer apart of the excavator can be given to a less experienced operator. Heavy equipment that are used in the project should meet the international standards. Anything else than that can pose a risk to the lives of many that are involved in the project. And lastly, groundwater control should be maintained. It is very crucial to maintain the groundwater control. Any sort of water leaking or vertical shaft can largely reduce the stand-up time. This will lead to a risk of a collapse if not checked in time. One can avoid the risk by installing dewatering pipes and pump the water out. Another technique can be used is ground freezing. Ground freezing is an expensive option, but quite effective. It freezes the ground and the soil surrounding the excavation until a permanent structure is built in its place. Again, you know, do what's smart in this uh, industry. Again, if you got any questions, give me a jingle, 817-733-3799. Thank you, and God bless.